Canada is made up of a diverse population, and this diversity should be represented in the medical professionals serving them. With recent changes announced by the government of Manitoba, rise in tuition fees may be a barrier in achieving a diverse student body. Recently, the government of Manitoba introduced Bill 31, which deregulates course-related fees and will allow for an increase of tuition to 5% plus inflation. The government of Manitoba also eliminated the tuition rebate, which allowed Manitobans to claim up to 60% of eligible tuition costs if they stayed and worked in Manitoba after graduating. These changes make university education less accessible and removes the incentive for graduated physicians to stay in Manitoba. Deregulation will lead to an increase of tuition fees with the fear of making medical school inaccessible and unaffordable to individuals from lower socioeconomic groups. A study published in the CMAJ showed that one year after the deregulation of medical school tuition in Ontario, the number of medical students in the province reporting family income of less than $40,000 dropped from 23% in 1997 to 15% in 2000. In that same time period, tuition increased 116% from $5,000 to $11,000. Incre increasing tuition rates reduces the number of medical students from lower income families. Why is diversity important? Studies have shown that patients have better health outcomes when they receive care from a provider that can appreciate or relate to their background and experiences. Physicians from low-income or ethnic minority backgrounds are more likely to serve traditionally underserved patient populations. Having a diverse medical student population leads to diversity in the medical profession, which can help address inequities in the health system. In 2009, the Canadian Medical Association expressed that high tuition fees coupled with insufficient financial support systems have a significant and detrimental impact on not only current and potential medical students, but also the Canadian healthcare system and public access to medical services. The University of Manitoba and the Manitoba government needs to assure us that the financial cost of medical school will not be a barrier to achieving a diverse student body.